what you see in is called firewood this is firewood it is primarily used to set fire in the villages of Ghana and this firewood is usually um, cut into pieces like this by women women are very strong in these areas unlike the women in the cities the women in these areas are very strong most of them are farmers real farmers in these areas and they farm cassava they, they farm plantain some of them even farm cocoa one of the greatest exports in ghana and when they farm it is not like they hire labor to come and undertake the operations and care for them they do it by themselves i have seen women here at the age of 60 80 they are in the farms farming by themselves every morning the person picks a cutlass Every morning she picks a cutlass, goes to the farm to farm and remove the weeds in her farm. It's so crazy. Women here are so special to the extent that you would compare their strength to Goliath. SubhanAllah. These people, if you look at what I was telling you, the firewood, it's so difficult in cutting in pieces. But you can imagine a tree like this, a tree like this was what was cut into the pieces that you saw earlier. A big tree like this you can see this is a cocoa tree yeah but this woman with an axe cut it into pieces but these days that's alhamdulillah machines have come that they sometimes hire the services of this um machine cutters yeah but they used to do it themselves and they never complain they never complain about feminism whatever, whatever bullshit that you guys are complaining about no they were very economical. They were hardworking. They made a lot of money. They were entrepreneurs. They were farm owners. They were big exporters. Among these women, you can find among them who are big exporters. And it's so beautiful that you come to areas like this and you look an old woman going to her farm, happy, not complaining, happy, not depressed, happy, not uh, blaming others. It's so beautiful. See, I'm living... I'm almost in the nice village now, yeah. So, and you see, as I'm showing you a village like this, it could be that you go inside the village and it's only one person that is in the village. And mostly, you can even find women who are the only persons in these villages. Let's say, one go school. Where are they? One is car. It's car, what do you school? Ten city. I say, what's it? What? On your ten city now? One, one fanya then. Huh? Ten city. What do you then? Hey, Ghana. I'm just uh, free as a just now. School fees. Ten city. Free as a just now. What did school fees are then? Two. 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 Baku five five city. And now baku ten ten city. Five city. Five city. And to whom am I? Okay. 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 And I was just want to get ten cd now. One go school. School better work. Mama, Apum. School better work. Huh? Mama, in Pacho Apum. Or or see school fees in the one go school. Oh boy. Uh huh. Oh boy. Now go only hang. Oh 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 oh. They be me a me video me ho. And I was just umbra. Me video mama me ho. I was just umbra. Uh -huh. That's a video. Debbie, me and I'm a video. Oh, that's a video. Oh, yeah. Uh huh. Me and I'm a video. Me, you video that I'm a video. I don't. I don't. Yeah. Oh, me, you video is ten years. Me, you video is me. Can you about a journey? A phone number, you know, 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 Okay. Okay. <laughs> so as I told you, most of these villages is just women that are that are there. Up here, understand? Ah, so beautiful, huh? Pray all my child that she give us the best in this world, give us the best in the hereafter. So beautiful places, man.
beautiful places in Ghana you would want to walk with me? Would you want to walk with me? Would you want to walk with me? Walk with Imu. <laughs> Assalamu alaikum. Wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.